In this video, I'll be showing you how to use the index and match functions in Excel. And so here we're given a uh, data set of monthly sales reports from different employees. And we want to figure out, for example, how much Bob earns in these different months. So press equals, type an in index, and select our array, which is always the entire data set. So highlight the entire table and dollar sign it. So later we can uh, drop, drag this formula down. And afterwards, we select our row number, which is where the match function comes in play. So type in match, choose our lookup value, which is the name of the employee, dollar sign that. Our lookup array are the rows, right? The rows of all the employee names, dollar sign that too. Our match type is zero or exact match. Close bracket, all right, and choose the column number, which is another match function. So our lookup value are the months here, September, August, July, and June. And June is blocked by the formula, but just select that. Our lookup array are the columns or the columns with the months here, dollar sign that, and we choose exact match again, right? Close the brackets, press enter, and we get the following. Bob earns $8 in June, which is correct. And since we dollar signed everything, we can just drag the formulas down like this, and we get that in July, he makes four, in August six, and September two, right? and. What's great about the index match function is you can just change the names of the employees, right? For example, if we wanted to see how much uh, Fiona earned, uh, we could do that. In June, she earned four. In July, six. August, five. September, 10 bucks, right? And so it's interactive. And if you guys want to look at the formula, I'll put it here like this. Okay, so that's it for the video. Uh, thank you for watching.